Hey guys, it's Crystal, and we are stepping into the next prompt with four um, that I've been working through. I've been working through Doodles Unleashed by Tracy Batsia. Her link for the magazine or for her book from Amazon will be in the down bar. Um, left off with the plates, we had so much fun with. And then we also did a doodling prompt, and I did a few, I did another one um, with paints. Yes, that's the exact same doodle prompt, so how cool, huh? Um, this one is one that she is did in there it's with circles, ink, and paint, and some clay. I didn't do... Um, Something I already do. And of course, also on the doodle jumpstart, she calls them um, doodled shapes. And that's what this is. It's just all kinds of shapes. You know, I did swirl, I did dots, I did lines, I did waves. It's just something doing shapes is a great one to do, she mentions. Now, this, this one um, is called, that we're going to do together, is letter doodles. It's write thoughts or phrases onto the page without lifting your pen. Draw circles, swirls, wavy lines that extend from each letter. Write backward, alternate, lowercase, uppercase. You get the drift. Just do it. Um, I'm looking for a paint pen that I want to play with. I have some paint pens. I don't know which one I want to use. Oh, there you go. I don't have the green. We did buy the green. Yes, we did. Okay. I want that. Maybe not. Maybe a dark blue. I really like that. We're going to go with that. It'll probably be a mistake, but oh well. And it's not then primed and proper, so let me get this here. Um, I'm really enjoying her book. Um, and as I said, I'm not sharing every little scrap in the book because you need to buy the book. You know, I gotta save something for you to buy the book if that's what you want. Um, but so far, so good. I'm liking it. I really, really am. I'm just going to start doing it like this just to get this going. This is one I'm actually inter really interested in. Um, because I love how seeing everybody's artist like, makes me hear, like, oh my god, that writing and it just looks so cool. I want to say the mixed media writing because it's kind of what it reminds me of. If you can do it, it's kind of, you know, it. So, okay, writing messily, huh? Not lifting your paid thing. Okay, here we go. Not lifting your thing. Oh, we're not supposed to write, lift our pen, pen huh? And I just did it again, I know. It doesn't really look like it, but it does look like it, actually. Um, I'm going to share this part with you. Um, I was going to actually gonna say, oh my god, I really sucked at that. But you look at it, like, right here. See how kind of messily it is? So I think I actually nailed that, really. Um... <laughs> At least a cool, a cool doodle, in my opinion. I'm gonna take this all the way around here. There we go. Very cool. That's kind of neat. I like it. So that is a quick one today, yes, is this writing. I think it's really neat. And um, I want to practice, practice, practice because 
like I said, some of you guys can just, and it looks so pretty. I do that, and I swear to God, it looks like a two-year-old writing it that has dyslexia. <laughs> because it's just not pretty, you know? And I mean, no disrespect to any of that. <laughs> oh, that's pretty. See, that's just what I needed for this piece. Um, ah, fun. Now, I'm, I'm not a doodler that has to doodle the whole pages. I'm really not into that. This I love. I love, love, love. Um, I hope you guys give it a whirl. And until the next video, which will be a longer video because we're going to be going into the kind of the next mini, the next subject, I guess is what you'd say. Um, so yay, it'll be a longer video. Can't wait. Happiness to you. Go make a mess and what? Smile and art it out. Bye guys.